Greetings, Bazalwan. Let me talk about grace just a bit. It doesn't make sense. Honestly, this grace thing doesn't make sense. It does not make sense. Lenda yogo tama ntu bahambe. Ba wenza izindo ezimbi. With the hope yogo tiba so kolelo. Nanga mpela ba kolelo. It doesn't make sense. Lendo yo musa doesn't make sense, Bazalwane. Uguti unkulunkule unkulunkulu. Ete eze mshabeni. Atate ilazo lo mundu. Apendure abe ilazo. Eskulje niso mundu. It doesn't make sense. My question is, if umusa doesn't make sense, did it make sense when Jesus Christ came down to die for you and me? Did it make sense? Unkulunkulu umwele. Unkulunkulu ashtanga ninte ngolide. Unkulunkulu umsulwa. Aweka makama nga kaza ubu mwele bugatika. Umutu onjalo. Engesha njana zofele umutu omubi. Unkulunkulu unkulunkulu ehle azofela. Does it make sense to you? Does it really make sense to you? Unkulunkulu abengege no matumele inge lo si zizofa. Kufayena unkulu. Does it make sense to you? The grace of God wouldn't make sense because the grace of God is different from what we perceive as grace, Tina. Sometimes we measure the grace of God according to the grace is in Ayotinus Mendigazabantu. That's not what Umusagan Kulukulonga call. The grace of God is not like that. It is beyond Uktabanga Wait. When the grace of God doesn't make sense, it means it's the grace of God. It doesn't have to make sense because it's the grace of God. When people sin, when people do all these things after they have believed, the grace of God, I find it. Kodwa umkulunkulu umusa wakhe uhlukile. Yinga akhe thumhlabeleni wehlukile wena Jesu awunakilinganiswa. The grace of God is so different, it's so amazing, that it forgives na lapo tina sinabantu siti benga mele na musia kolelo. But the grace of God, wesha waba ishazo eskunden sedu. That did not make sense. Unkulu kulu vela ga zenzi zinte zenzi sedu ga kulu ga ziti na sinabantu. Ngoba o mkulu kulu. It doesn't make kululu ukuthi sijudge abantu ukuthi ba wrong bese siya bahlulela But that is not God God is different The grace of God is sufficient for everyone You just have to believe You just have to believe in the gospel and his righteousness will be imputed into your account Ulunga kankulu kulu kuletu wakuwe. Ulunga unga lungile. Omu bigotwa ulunga nge nga kresto. Your standing with, with God is not determined by the things that you do. Kodwa kuvezwa owenzo ukrai ukresto e kalvar. Ugutuwe na umuse na mumu bikulu kulu Ati ugutuwe nze luguto Nga pandi kogutu kore And then you remain righteous Nge na ugutu utiko ubona ukrest Christ in us Kwa leto ukrest wa shala nati nati sa shala guwe Oma usheli no krest Oma ukrest e ikanda lebali E nwele Then the whole body has to be holy it will not make sense that the head of the church, the head of the body, is holy and the body is filthy. The body is made holy through Christ the head. 
Ogunwe lebrati kobe tela git. Gen laga kest ogit. Nakoge. It doesn't have to make sense to go abantu bayo na bakole. Vele musa kumkulu kulu unjalo. It doesn't have to make sense because we have a finite mind. Sometimes it is kumkulu kulu gege sa scroll. We will never understand. Ugu uti kuyen zaganja lento ugu uti uti suone. Ugu uti ugu be benga abantu be be chacha benga mele ngabe atetelelo. Kuto uti ko atetelelo. Umusa nkulunkulu wanele bonke. Uma ubonu umusa nkulunkulu mngane manga pekona banyi. Besu ubonu mkulu magona we. Ngoba ninjano. How many times have you committed isone soto? Uspinda pinda. But you still expected God to forgive you. And let me, let me, let me tell you. He forgave you. Only if you believed. Because your sins are forgiven only when you have believed in the finished work of the cross. Zinga agizo no zenzi ilu spinda pinda. Usukoli sile, you even promised God to kutingegu pindu zenzi, kutu zenzi. God forgave you. His grace is sufficient. Umusa nkulu nkulu ngege sa ukaonda. Unjalu umusa nkulu nkulu. Maunga ni mepi kumusa na mkulu mkulu manga vese sponi zonu sabanya bantu. Kube ngaza takasa itetele leze zonu ngoba zonu ngaza tizone ishu ile kwe zetu. God forgives every sin. Wongu mutu who has believed in the finished work of the cross as per 1 Corinthians chapter 15 verse 1 to 4. Isonu sakesi ya kone. It is blasphemous to say your sins are not forgiven while you are preaching good to Christ who are for Felix on Ozako. I mean, it doesn't make sense. Why would you say Christ died for your sin and then all of a sudden you've got sins, you, 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 can't why fell asleep? Yes, it doesn't have to make sense because when God died, when I was your call, when I was your Kukolelo izo no zako zaga mungu. Kukolelo lezo zenze manji. Kukolelo nezo zenze. But does that give you a license to sin? Well, of course not. Uma yungu uze iba ndela se Roma. Uguti ngabe nenka yungu uze segmele sone na utu utu poli kana gani. Ana zini nitina afana afana ina fuga na ina. Na se mfugile kupili nubushu. Umu uze nkulu nkulu teaches you to do the right things. To stay away from ungodliness. That is what the book of Titus chapter 2 verse 11 to 12 says. Umusa lankulunkul will never give you a permission or a license to sin. Umusa lankulunkul ufundisa ugwenza ugul. You just have to work out your own salvation. You just have to have your mind transformed. And the only way to have your mind transformed is by the reading of the word. Read the word every day. Literally every day. Read the word. Goba, upol, uposto upol, mei kuluma ngofunda izu. Uti sizo kezwa, nge si kezo, sezwi. There is no magic in this thing. You just have to fill your mind with the word every day until your subconscious mind thinks like Christ. Because, uto upol, we have to have the mind of Christ. And having the mind of Christ is not a magical thing. But you have to read. That is why I told Pastor Paul, follow me as I follow Christ. Read the Bible every day. And then your mind is transformed. And then you begin to do the right thing. So your sinful nature is being changed by a new person. Now your sinful nature has changed. Now you are righteous. Because of the righteousness of Christ that has been imputed into your account. And then when you read the word, every day your mind is being transformed. And your subconscious mind is being influenced by the word. And you begin to do the right things effortlessly. So when you sin, Because you know what is When you are righteous and you are But because Sipilaglo Mshaba will definitely sin. 
kodwa izinto eziningi esizozenza kuzoba izinto ezilatchas then ukona and uma kwenzeka sona sizoyisola but you need to understand ukuthi usola ngenxa yenembezo nayo kodwa you see is forgiven be assured if you think that your sin is not forgiven you are being blasphemous kusho ukuthi uqonde ukuthi Christ ngikathefa wafela izono ezithize igazi lakha linawo amandla ogeza lezi zono oyijele ukuthi yinkulu angeke nande kakhulu kunezono eziningi singabantu because of the society esizibukwe kwangaze ukuthi zine impondo odlule ezinye ngendlela ukuthi when you look at those scenes sibona sengazi ukuthi lezi ngeke ziwazi uqoleleka let me assure you today asikho isono esikhulula igazi lika Jesu All sins are forgiven when you believe in the finished work of the cross. If kwenzeka ubuhluleka ngento ethize before you believe in the finished work of the cross, you just have to after you have believed, you just have to grow in the knowledge of Christ. How do you do that? By having your mind transformed. How do you do that? Read the word every day. And then because you are sealed by the Holy Spirit when you believe, it helps you to understand the scriptures. So when you read Utholi understanding usizomoya ngcwele kube khona izinto osuzi understanda ngendlela ehlukile before you believed and then you begin to do the right things so even izinto ebezihlulu ngakakholwa sekuzobalula ukuthi usishiye because now your mind has been transformed grace teaches us to stay away from ungodliness it doesn't make sense i know it doesn't make sense kwangazathi sibuya ngazathi ivangele lisha this thing has always been there because besina food sesi itholile manje i'm talking to everyone especially those who has been there in we faith who has been there in faith for iskat eside abay abangezwani naledi abay egrace who still believe that the mkhwepha yabo nange nange ezinto abazenzayo bangazenza bamkeleke ukuthi kodwa uthi umpostor paul mangabe bhala in the book of ephesians chapter 2 verse 6 for by grace you are saved through faith we are all sisindiswa ngomuswa sina sala ndo singenza ngalutho safelo singenza ngalutho ngakho kuko futhi esingaku okunye singakwenza ukuze sisuse uthando lwakhe nithi yena ngihlonisa nothando lika Kristo apostle paul ubala zonke izinto ezingahlonisa nothando lika Kristo uthi akukho nakanye akukho nokodwa ongasihlonisa nothando lika Kristo sathandwa singenza ngalutho ngakho akukho singakwenza ukuze singathandwa we are loved this season is in jan we are special we are special nalo abantu bobukela phansi nalo abantu buye church benze izono eyinkulu nezakho you should know but if they believe in the finished work of the cross they are just as special as you and you'll be surprised when you meet them in heaven ngikhuluma nawe oyijele ukuthi wona kancane nginabaye may the good lord be with you while you enjoy this message digest it ungayilaleli ngendlela ukuthi ufuna ukuyiphikisa kodwa ithathe with an open heart uyihlole kuma scriptures Bese yethatha. Kosemusibusise in Jesus name. Amen.